Guys, I know it has been such a long time. I've just been working so hard on all of this stuff to show you. Um, I wanted to do like a year in review video, but I think I'm gonna do an update on the, um, golly, what is it even called? I don't know what to call it yet. Um, that will be up to you guys. How about that? It's all of the nano tanks in the corner for the bettas um, and everything else like that. If I can hold this steady. Um, I wanted to do an update video on that just because it's done. Uh, it is fully completed. Uh, all the heaters are in, all the filters are running, all the lights are on. Um, and I'm looking at it right now and it's making me really <laughs> excited. That's awesome. Um, and I guess I'll, I'll show you guys um, uh, what I did with the tanks. Um, and then there's not very many fish in there right now. There's a few in some of the tanks, but not in very many just because um, I haven't been able to get very much since Christmas and since uh, New Year's and all that. Uh, the airlines are terrible right now for shipping. So um, make sure you give your local fish stores some, some grace period right now. Um, but yeah, let's take a look uh, and I will show you what we did. Oh, right here is the uh, forementioned, I guess it's not a uh, named place yet. Like we have that, that's the freshwater room. This is the island. The other one over there is the uh, saltwater room. I guess this needs a name, whether it be Nano Corner, whether it be uh, Beta Corner, Beta Barracks. I love that. Um, we'll take a look, and if y'all have any ideas, you let me know. Um, but we've done a few things. Some of the plants need replanted, and, and some of the um, tanks don't even have plants yet. But uh, we'll take a look at each of these. Uh, each tank is kind of very easily, let me get out of that shot, um, very easily set up. We have a, a preset heater, um, which we're gonna order some different heaters to put in there, but for, for now they do their purpose. And then a small uh, filter and a light. And the lights are actually a uh, strip light company based out of Massachusetts that makes horticulture lights. So they are perfectly fine to grow plants. Um, and are, there are four on each of these timers so when I turn that off, all four of those on the top go out. Uh, and then I can also cycle through each of them to where I think it's this one that turns off first. Yep, that one, and then that one, and then that one, and then that one will turn off and then they'll all turn back on. Um, I can also change the, let's see, boop, 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 how bright they are. So if we get some fish that don't like bright uh, tanks very much, I can still have some light. Um, but yes, they are wonderful. We've got a few fish in here, a lot of plants, a lot of uh, Nubis Nana, which that is looking gorgeous. Look at that, Nubis Nana. It is very, very, very pretty. Um, in this tank, actually, there is a fish. Let me see if I can find them. There's actually one right there. Look at him. He's just sitting on the, let's see if we can focus and zoom there. A uh, little stone catfish. <laughs> I love them. They look like little airplanes. Let's see if we can, oh yeah. Oh no, oh no, oh no, here they all come. <laughs> I love those little fish, they're so wonderful. Um, but yeah, we've got them, uh, we've got tanks full of java fern, um, and then we have up here some imperial ranger plecos. They've become some of my favorites. I think he's my last one. We had 20 of them and they all sold in one week. Um, well, I guess it's been more than one week. It's been two weeks since New Year's. So two weeks, we've got some orange cheladenios in this tank. Um, it is cycling for some rosy barbs, but if you kind of get the idea, we're gonna have them all scaped kind of like this um, and keep nano fish in them and shrimp. Oh golly, this is so gorgeous. That's so beautiful. <laughs> oh, it makes me happy. Wow. They just look so good. Like, I don't know if y'all, have ever worked really hard to accomplish a dream um, but this is one of those things because now all of our bettas will have uh, their own tanks uh, we'll be able to keep a lot more they look so so nice um, I'm so excited so y'all need to come and see me here let me turn the camera around keep in mind that this Wednesday I'm getting a bunch of betta fish and a bunch of nano fish to put in those tanks because they're finally cycled oh look at this guy look at this guy he's sitting on a snail He's visiting. He's like, put me in the video. <laughs> um, but yeah, keep in mind that I'm getting a lot of fish on um, this Wednesday and this Friday. Um, and come and see me.